Hello guys welcome back to the channel i hope you all are doing extremely fine my name is prince and you are watching the tech stream in this video i am going to revisit one of the best android 12 custom rom project zephris for the oneplus 8 series and oneplus 9r so without wasting any more time let's get started as you can see i have installed zephris also known as proton knockoff which is an android 12.1 based custom rom on my oneplus 8t if we go into the about info section you can see that the android version is 12 and you get the latest security patch of 5th may 20 22 kudos to the developer for pushing out updates so fast i'll just show you what this rom provides and what all you can expect also in this video i'm not going to show you how to install this rom for that you can check the video in the i button and the description below so the rom is very very stable fast and responsive i mean just have a look at how fast this rom actually is i'm using it as a daily driver for a couple of days or so and face no trouble all the basic functionality works properly wifi bluetooth nfc volt and calling everything just works fine The fingerprint sensor also works flawlessly. It is a little slow as compared to Android 11 ROM, but it does the job. And you also get face unlock support. However, the app locker is not present currently, but it will be added soon. Moving on, since this is an Android 12 ROM, it has all the amazing features from Android 12.1, which includes material U theming, newer UI and animation, and the new wallpaper switcher with all the pixel specific features. Each of the features just work fine without any hiccups as it should. Safety net also passes on this ROM out of the box, and all the banking and payment apps work just fine. The wide Fine security level is L1, so that means you'll be able to stream HD content on Netflix and other streaming sites. Talking about the camera, this ROM comes with Oxygen OS camera and gallery app, and yes, Oxygen OS camera is fully functional without any issues. And the same goes for the gallery app; it also works well as it used to work on Oxygen OS. Moving on, another good thing about this ROM is that it supports full 90 FPS in gaming, so you can play BGM or Call of Duty Mobile on 90 FPS. You can see that the FPS meter here at the top shows 90 FPS, and I'm thinking of making a full 90 fps gaming review on this rom comment down if you want me to make that video talking about the battery the battery backup is also good and there are no considered drain as such on average i'm getting 6 to 7 hours of screen on time now let's talk about the customization options that are available on this rom the customization section are scattered over various part of the rom first up under network and internet we have some network switches option toggle to enable or disable the volti icons and even select the type of volti icons and below that we have traffic indicator settings moving on Under notifications, we have options for customizing edge lighting and heads up notifications. Next up, under battery, you can select the custom battery styles and battery percentage settings. Next, under sounds, you get music visualizer options. Moving on, under display, you get a lot of options. First up, we have status bar and fonts, and you get a plethora of fonts to choose from. Below that, you have icon packs for status bar, Wi-Fi, and signal icons. And then we have options like smooth display and force 120 hertz refresh rate. Then at last, we have other settings like double tap on the lock screen to sleep. and wait and last but not the least you have got some device extra settings where we have options like dolby atmos alert slider customization the screen gestures ambient display gestures auto high brightness mode fps overlay game mode unlimited edge touch and system vibrator strength i know these features are not organized in a single place but this rom does provide a lot of options to play with so for the final verdict i really like this rom as it is very solid has oxygen os camera fully working it has a plenty of customization options and bgmi runs at 90 FPS on this one. You can have a taste of Android 12.1 with a stable experience with this ROM, and there is a lot of development going on, so you'll receive a lot of new features and updates very frequently. A big thanks to the developer for all the hard work. Definitely a very very good and stable ROM, and would recommend everyone to try it. If you want to know how to install this ROM on the OnePlus 8 series and OnePlus 9R, there's a card to that video. Also, I make a lot of ROM reviews, and I'll be trying other Android 12 ROMs such as Blaze OS and Cherish OS. Subscribe to the channel to not miss those videos. Thank you for watching.